Alexander Skarsgård is often shared his hopes of becoming a father and starting his own family. Finally, after all these years, his dream has come true. Yep, that's right. Alexander is a dad. A dad. The actor and his girlfriend, Tuva Navatny, have maintained a strict level of privacy around their relationship since they started dating. So much so that they've yet to confirm their romance with the public. However, the actor couldn't help but share his excitement over becoming a father. I was so happy I cried. Alexander Skarsgård and his girlfriend, 43-year-old Tuva Navatny, welcomed their first child together several months ago. Although they kept the baby's name and gender under wraps, 46-year-old Skarsgård confirmed the exciting news at the red carpet premiere for the fourth season of Succession on the 20th of March. While Tuva didn't attend the event, Alexander happily accepted the many congratulations that were given. He shared that he was enjoying fatherhood and even showed off a stuffed animal he received earlier that evening from a fan. The couple first sparked romance rumors at the beginning of 2022, but they have kept most of the details of their relationship private. It's not known how the pair met, but both actors featured in the series The Kingdom Exodus, which aired in November of that year. It's possible that they were first introduced when filming for the series started in 2021, although we can't be too sure. She's uh, such, uh, obviously an amazing actor, but to, to, we're also, she's a, a dear friend. Since they're both native Swedes, it could be that their shared circles allowed them to cross paths at some point before that too. Navani debuted her growing baby bump in April 2022 at the Elle Fashion Awards. However, she kept the details of her pregnancy to herself. When she was asked to elaborate on the exciting news, the actress only confirmed that she was expecting. Despite not having confirmed their relationship, Alexander and Tuva fueled more romance rumors when they were spotted together in New York City in November later that year. At the time, the pair were spotted pushing a baby stroller down the street and holding a swaddled newborn. Naturally, their outing raised a lot of questions, but the couple wasn't phased about answering any of them. Alexander is no stranger to the spotlight, although he prefers to keep his private life away from it. Coming from a family of highly respected and talented actors, Skarsgård was well aware of the attention that came with the career. His father, Stellan Skarsgård, has worked as an actor since the 1970s. Alexander and his siblings, Bill, Gustav, and Walter, all chose to follow in their father's footsteps. Stellan taught them the importance of keeping their personal lives separate from work, and they all held strongly onto his advice. Alexander explained that his father was a great influence on how he approached the media with his personal life. Yeah, I don't talk about it much, and that's a way to protect it. When I was a kid, that's how my father dealt with it. The fact that he protected his private life so much and protected my mom, who is not an actor or a public figure. Skarsgård's career gained traction following the release of the hit TV series True Blood back in 2008. He became an instant heartthrob and soon featured in numerous other projects like The Legend of Tarzan, Big Little Eyes, and The Northmen. Like Alexander, Novotny also came from a creative family and was raised in Stockholm. She's the daughter of Czech film director David Novotny and Swedish artist Barbro Hedström. Her parents clearly passed on their talents and the actress rose to fame as a result of their own unique creative spark. Tuva grew up having a love for theater and started acting at the age of 16. Since then, she has blossomed into an acclaimed actress and garnered attention for her roles in both film and television. Although she's widely known by European audiences, she's featured in several American films too. You might recognize her from movies like Eat, Pray, Love, Blind Spot, and most recently, Diorama. While Skarsgård has just become a dad for the first time, Novotny was already a mother long before they met. The actress shares a 16-year-old daughter, Ella, with her ex, Nikolai. The former couple had their daughter in 2007. Other than that, there isn't much known about their relationship or why they eventually split. We're sure Alexander welcomed the opportunity to be a stepfather since he's often spoken about his dream of having a big family. During a 2017 interview, the actor revealed that he was excited to become a dad at some point in the future and hoped to have a lot of kids. I want to beat my dad. He had eight. I better get cracking, I guess, he added. My dad is 65 and he had a kid four years ago. I'm born in the 70s. My dad had kids in the 70s, in the 80s, in the 90s, in the 2000s, and the 2010s. The actor explained that growing up with a lot of siblings was chaotic at times, but he wouldn't have had it any other way. I grew up in a madhouse, but I thought it was really cool. Skarsgård recalled his childhood fondly, saying that it was fun and there were lots of people and dogs running around. He described it as a kind of bohemian household, with his cousins living upstairs and his grandparents living across the street. They should make a sitcom about it because it was at least 20 people for dinner every night, he joked. While the actor was open to speaking about his childhood and home life, he hasn't shared much about his past romantic relationships. 
Over the years, he was linked to several high-profile actors, including Alexa Chung, Amanda Seyfried, Evan Rachel Wood, and Kate Bosworth. With Tuva, it seemed as though Alexander didn't have a problem being single. Despite wanting to have a family of his own, during a 2018 interview, the actor said, I'm not married, and I don't have kids, and I'm really enjoying it at the moment. The contrast of wanting to become a father but enjoying his single life made it appear as though Skarsgård wasn't sure of what he really wanted. Or perhaps he just hadn't met the right person to start a family with just yet. Alexander had openly admitted that he was a romantic at heart, and he wasn't going to share his life with just anyone. I'm not going to settle and say, oh you're alright, let's make a family. I'm more romantic than that. Many of the actors' previous relationships were rather short and fleeting. After working together on True Blood, Evan Rachel Wood and Skarsgård dated in 2009. The former couple didn't publicly speak about their romance. However, Wood all but confirmed the pair were together after letting slip she dated one of her cast members. After his split with Evan, Alexander dated Kate Bosworth for around two years. It was reported that the actor had even planned to propose to Kate, but unfortunately he never got the chance. Bosworth was allegedly the one who called off their relationship in 2011, and she quickly went on to marry Michael Polish. While the reason for their split remains unknown, perhaps it was because Skarsgård didn't pop the question soon enough. When he was asked about his former relationship with Kate, Alexander was adamant about keeping the details to himself. He responded, I make it a rule not to talk about myself and Kate. I so desperately try to keep my private life out of the tabloids, because becoming a celebrity rather than an actor can really get in the way of a good performance. One of his longest on and off relationships is with British TV producer and model Alexa Chung. The former couple first sparked romance rumors in 2015, and like his previous relationships, they flew relatively under the radar. Although they split two years later, the pair were often seen spending a lot of time together. They briefly gave their romance another chance in 2018, but eventually ended their relationship for good. Following the breakup with Chung, Skarsgård shared, I was with a girl for a couple of years, and it ended up not working out, but we're still close friends. Until now, Alexander appeared to be focused solely on his career. Perhaps he wasn't ready to settle down yet and wanted to make sure he made that commitment when the time was right. Balancing the need for a family and kids while building his career couldn't have been easy for him. It's possible that he wanted to be sure that when the right person came around, he would be able to give all of his time and energy to being a family man. It seems as though Tuva has put all of his hesitations to rest. With her by his side, Skarsgård has finally been able to achieve his dream of becoming a father and starting a family of his own. Whether or not they plan to get married is still up for debate, but we're sure the couple will make the decision based on what works best for them. One thing is for sure, Alexander is going to make a great father, and we're so excited about his new journey as a parent. We're so happy that he finally found the right person to share his life with and grow a family. We wish Alexander and Tuva only the best for their future together. Be well and be kind.